Here we go, guys. We are here at in Pasadena, California. I'm doing an air show for the Air Force versus James Madison game, the Armed Forces Ball. Here we go. So here we go. I, it, it's in. So he drops back, like he runs. Is he? Yep, he is. And then overthrown for an incompletion. Air Force 28, Madison, James Madison 14. James Madison is punching, it's 4th and 15, so let's go. I'm, I'm rooting for Air Force, by the way, so yeah. And it is a fair catch by Air Force. James Madison, a pretty good team, in my opinion, but I think Air Force has a really good team I which they're leading right now I think they're a really tough tougher team than James Madison it we're in the third quarter I just started filming right away honestly but um Air Force is actually here and Air Force is just one of the greatest like they're probably the second best Mac team the best Mac team actually right now and he is stopped for about minus one yard or he's at the line of, line of scrimmage and if you wanted to go to capital one it, it's here so yeah it, it just says that on it so yeah here we go and Rush yards, Air Force has 279, James Madison has 20, so yeah. Here we go. Air Force snaps the ball, they run, and he gains about four yards. Four, actually, they act, Air Force actually gained um, two Two yards on that play, surprisingly. I don't know how, but, like, I think when the player goes back, it matters where he left from. I think that's how it works. I don't know. Third and four. Yes, I was right. He gained about, he gained four yards. And Air Force was, I think, nine and four. So, basically the same record if they win. And he is going to run for three yards, I think. Fourth and one for Air Force. Let's see. So he runs to the outside. He runs to the outside, and that's it. For the fourth down conversions, 15 of 22, 68, 68%. They've made half of them today. And he, I think he got it. Yes, he did get it. Yep, that's the first down. He got it. It was, it was a quarterback sneak, and he got it. I, I think. He did. Okay, I think they're going to measure this. Let's see if he was down. I don't know. I Yeah, I think I think he got there. Let's see. He got that. Yep, that's a first down. Yep. A hurry up offense. So, let's go. They're going to pass, I think. Yes, and Ooh. Incomplete pass. I thought he was going to catch that, but nope, overthrown, I think. So, yeah. UConn in the in basketball. Vanderbilt is leading 62-54 to 54 against number 23, Memphis, in the top 25 basketball, so if you want to watch that. But let's go. Bowl for the Braves. I think. Yep, both for three. And he, oh, what a hit. What a hit. What a, what a hit. 
by number seven for James Madison. Dang. Wow. He gained six yards on that play, third and four. I like the Air Force's mascot. They're showing it right now. I like it, honestly. And commercial break. Okay, guys, while the commercial break is here, we're going to talk about the college football playoff. Now, if you want anything, let me turn that down for a second. So, in the college foot, I think the score prediction is that Alabama goes to national championship. But they beat Michigan forty nine to forty eight or fifty nine to forty nine. My prediction for the Texas versus Washington game is basically going to be the same as for as Alabama's forty eight forty five or sixty sixty three fifty nine. That's my prediction. But my number one so. But Texas is a good team. Give me Alabama to take home the national championship, baby. Defeating Texas 63-3. to Now, now you Texas fans, shut up. We're going to blow you out, boys. We're going to win this national championship, baby. Let's go. No one ain't stopping us. So let's go. Bro, this is the longest commercial break I've ever seen. <laughs> How long does a timeout last? That's my question. It it's been like one two minutes. I think. Yep, it has. Or I'm just kidding, it's been like 40 seconds, I think. Oh, we're back on. I think. I... Bro, this is... This wants me... Wants me make to cry, man. It's a children's hospital. And, like, they're sick. It makes me sad, man. Oh, I think this is, like, about a VR headset or something. Oh, wait. Starlight.org. Yeah. Check that out. Check that app out, actually. Oh, we're back. Welcome back to the Lightning Martin Armed Forces Ball as part of the 60, yes. 62 rush yards per game allowed. James, per ja with James Madison, they lead the FBS in that. Also, by the way, my favorite team in the FCS is South Dakota State. So, yeah. Here. Oh, I did not see that coming. He I, he rushed for a first down. So, the, he, he gained the first down on third and fourth. Here and Air Force rushes for about five, four, five, or six. Probably like five, I think. Four, five, or six yards. Today, 304 rush yards for Air Force. That's incredible. 6.2 rush yards a rush. 
Dang, man. Oh, yeah, I was right. They gained five yards. So, yeah. <coughs> Sorry. Um, Air Force snaps it. They're going to run again for about one or two yards. They got to about the 25-yard line. They gained one yard. Oh, sorry. For, at the 30-yard line. I mixed up. Sorry. Third and four again for Air Force. Here we go. And he's going to rush for the first down. And he gets to the 24-yard line. I think he rushed for about two two yards past the first down marker. He gained six yards on that play. Bro, y'all, Air Force is a good running team. I'm just saying. Ten plays. Ten plays, 33 yards for Air Force. Oh, they're at the 25, I think. Yep, and they gain three or two yards. Two or three yards. Here we go. Won four straight bowl games, Air Force. Air Force has won four straight bowl games. Wow. This will be their fifth straight if they win, which I think it's going to be like 38-14 or 38-21. That's my prediction. Or 35-21, 35-14. And they gain about, they gain two yards on that play. So, yeah. On third down again, third and six, here we go. Air Force runs, and he gets another first down on the ground. He gains seven yards that play, and they are in the red zone. Man, Air Force is killing it on the run. They get to the 14 yard line. They're going to rush for about one yard. Oh, I, he might have lost yardage on that play. Or did he gain one yard? I think he gained one yard. This is the... This is the good thing about Air Force. They run the clock down. They're, they manage the game perfectly. So let's go. Here we go. He's going to rush in. And he's going to... No, he didn't rush in. Sorry. Um, he gained about seven yards on that play. Third and two or third and three. He gained six or seven yards. They're inside the five yard line. Wait, what? They gained five yards? I thought it was like seven. And they get stopped on first, on third down. Oh. 
And they are going to bring out the field goal team. Matthew DePoor, a junior for Air Force, has made 14 of 18 of his field goals, made 77.8 of his field goals, and his, and his career long is 50 yards. This is 20, a 26-yard field goal. This is basically a chip shot. And it is good from 26 yards. It is good. 17 plays, 49 yards, guys. They managed the game perfectly. I'm telling you. This is no Okay, see ya. It's forged from the guts of a U.S. fighter jet. We will continue this video, but I kind of want to skip this. And the USS Fort Worth combat ship. It represents honor, bravery, sacrifice. This is no ordinary. This game is sponsored. Sponsor of the college professional stage against the high flying Oregon Ducks. Liberty University versus the or Oregon University and the Fiesta Bowl. Number 18 versus number 18 ranked Liberty, which they should be in the college football playoff. I'm just kidding. Wait, yeah, they should they should be ranked. Oh, Texas. Alabama shouldn't be number four. Texas should be number five. Liberty is actually in the no, or, no Oklahoma beat Texas. Never mind. Who do y'all think? Who would win, Florida State or Liberty? Comment down below. 